what's going on? I don't know. White Sox Dave's got some plan. So as the office discussed, when Molly and Patty get here in a few minutes, they're coming at 1.30, right? The office decided that we're going to let Molly kick Ed, and Ed's not allowing it. And I say it's not his choice, but he who's, says it is. Who's the office that decided? Everybody here. You could get kicked. I'm not getting kicked. Why? Because I don't like stealing bits. That's Robbie's bits. I believe in fresh bits. I don't think bits. that's Robbie's bit. I think that's and anybody. I think, who... uh, I think we should leave that bit to Robbie. I respect Robbie a lot. He does a lot with spinning breakfast. He does a lot with uh, respect. our MMA content. So I'm going to leave that to him. I got choked out by Curtis Blaze. Isn't it your turn? Oh, shit. No, it's your turn. That's your bit. Are you afraid of a girl? No, not at all. I would beat the shit out of her. <laughs> <laughs> you know why, Ed? Why? Because she's a girl. I want to beat the shit out of her. She would fucking choke me out in 10 seconds. What's up, Harry? Nice to meet you, Eddie. Hey, I'm Dave. Nice to meet you, man. Uh, nice to meet you, man. Uh, nice to meet you, man. Eddie, how are you? What? What's up? We've got major trackies. Let's go to get ready to go. Oh, again, what's up? Okay. How are you? Good nice to meet you. How are you doing? Get on this, lads. Oh, look at this stuff. <laughs> Yeah, Dave's it. Funny that we were saying to Dave last week we need we need a tracky and then the rear. Oh, nice oh, stuff. How's it been going? I didn't even know we had those. Yeah. Molly the, the meatball now. Oh, what you think? My team's blue and Paddy's is red, oh, so. You guys are gonna tell me about this team. I'm being recruited. Should I root for them or no? Oh, oh my yes. god! That's where I she's should? from! <laughs> someone sent me this from uh, Who's Someone from England, I don't know. I was told I should be an Everton fan. That they're a bunch of losers and they make me miserable like my teams do. Yeah, well, uh, what teams do you support? I don't I don't follow soccer. No, in other sports? Baseball. What's what who do you support in baseball and yeah, football? Baseball, football, yeah. American football. White Which Sox. Teams? They're a bunch of losers and I hate them. But they're like all I care about. So the White Sox. Bears, they're losers too though. All my teams just make me miserable, so this is a green wall. Green screen, yeah. A green screen, yeah. So you can do whatever you want with the Photoshop you in. Giving fucking elbows. Everyone gets them. We'll show it. We'll get a preview of Valentina. You give her one. It's gonna happen one day. I know. I believe it. Oh, was this when they do the live? Yes. Yeah, virtual. So I, yeah. Yes. Uh huh. So this is the one I did the show with Dave from. I'm gonna have to give you something to go on there. Yeah, that'd be awesome. I'd love that. I send you something from the last fight. Mm -hmm. I'll give you like my sports bra. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be funny. <laughs> that. It's a lot more cleaner than New York. Oh, New York's right? gross. Have you guys had an Italian beef yet? No. So it's a uh, it's a food that's oh. native to Chicago, and uh, it's like a it's kind of like the Philly cheesesteak. Okay. And we make our own kits and we sell them. Nice. Go buy one. TasteRealChicago.com. Oh, it's just like being back at home. Yeah, Do you come the ring? No, 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 they don't work. It's just for show? Just for show. <laughs> uh -huh. I can't wait till I can't, don't have to fight anymore and I can just do this stuff. Yeah, you just hang out <laughs> The easiest us. stuff, yeah. Yeah, exactly. Just watch. And then, uh, this is cool. A little secret, uh... <laughs> <laughs> smells a lot stronger than proper smell. <laughs> We'll put this one on camera. Let's see if she goes here. That was a warm up. Let's see if she goes here. There's the line. There's the line right there. Go. Good. 17. Welcome to Chicago. You've been on the floor. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, God. Good shit. 18. 180. 180. Bulls out. I've got them. I've said on my vlogs before as well. I'd love to be able to just be good at darts. It'll just be like, boom, cherry coke. <laughs> boom. Like, believe, believe in yourself. Oh! oh what's the thing? We got a star. That's 25. Yeah, 25? Oh, that's 25. a good star. Two darts. I need a 50, though. That's all right. That's I need a 50. Right. <laughs> just go triple 20. That's a respectable score. Yeah. Oh. We did one more. Oh! oh. Then we one more for. To extend the time. Oh, fuck. That was a oh, respectable <laughs> score. Yeah. That didn't even count that. Oh. That basket. Oh. It's a piece of shit. <laughs> didn't even count one of the baskets then. It is life. 
Oh yeah, this is about six o'clock Friday night. All right, we're back again this year. We did it last year. It was one of our first Chicago Sulsons episode at the Connor Scott Zeke Foundation Golf Tournament. We're out here in Avon, Connecticut, Avon Country Club. Glorious day, beautiful day, beautiful outfit. Pan out, look at this. We got mustard socks, we got hot dog pants, we got a fucking American icon, a legend, Joey Chestnut. We're dogs today. Our team is dogs, we're hunting birdies. We're out here to win. We're out here to win best dress and we're gonna get it done all for the Connor Scott Zeke Foundation gonna be a great day. There we go. See, there, Dave could there, never do there. that. Dave could never do that. Dude. Am I awesome? Am I just awesome at this game? I think it's the pants. Yeah. <laughs> Gotta be. I mean, Lance, are you getting this? That looks good, I'm dude. A, I'm a, I might just be a tour pro. I picked the wrong job talking about nonsense on the internet. I should've just gone into golf. I'm feeling, uh, I'm feeling great, but not because of my ability. We got the tour pro. That's good. We got Dougie, who apparently is a stud. And then Jake and I are here for the vibes. So we're going to have a good time. I'm just hoping to you know, announce my presence with authority on this one and just get it further than whatever White Sox Dave did at the Open. I think he hit it about six feet. I think I'll beat that. All right. Whoa, look at that shake. Boys, we're hot. I think I was aiming that way. I see it all. Yeah, he's really good. And like just the confidence, like he's like, oh yeah, and like that's on there. He's like, we're fine. I'm like, no, we're not fine. We're not fine. I'm on the team. We're not fine. I just might be awesome at this you game. Are. I don't know what. If I just take a year off in between, don't think, then I just that smash them. Is... This, this is the thing. Where Dave's always like, I'm a better athlete than you. I can. I'm better than you in golf. If we play golf, I would beat you. I'm stroking shots out here. I'm just, I'm on the dance floor all day long. Dave stinks. He can't even get out of the tee box. <laughs> I was waiting the year. Cigar, right? Yeah. You always cigar. Oh, you always, thank you, you so much. Need oh. You guys need it. We got the Joel, the Joel special right here. We got a match. You got a match? I think you're good to go there. <coughs> it's not good at <laughs> Cut that. I've been battling a cold. It's not me, I'm not a little bitch. I'm just, just the cold talking. Fuck you, Lance. <laughs> Whatever. Get out of my face! It's, wind, it's windy. I've had a good time with you today. I enjoy your company very much. I might just move to Connecticut. <laughs> That's how you wear your sunglasses when you know you're sweet at golf. Just tuck them in the back, sun upside down. Sun, sun like badass. there you go. You see? You got it. Nope, you little pussy. Not a terrible idea to putt it though. You like putting better. <laughs> You've been way. here today. <laughs> Falling apart a little bit here. Myself personally, the team's going well, but might be my game. Might be the cocktail. I'm not sure. Yeah, so I go to those little... Not a good idea to drop. That's a high shot. last year when it was 100 degrees. Mel. Somehow last year I feel like we came here four so times. I'm so upset Eddie's not here taking it's another it. car bomb. <laughs> it's a hot day for car bombs. Two car bombs kind of rattled my cage a little bit. It's only whole seven. I'm in trouble. <laughs> you know who, uh, who's more upset? Oh, yes. oh, got, like, I just wanted Eddie too. when he was just like, oh, here, dude, no, like, I can't. All right, all right, I'll save the day again. <laughs> hey, yeah. If balance is going to inform me, looking cool at any point during the day today is this. Is can, I, can I tell you the truth? Balance and looking cool are two things that I've always had problems with. <laughs> always had problems with. You keep telling me, oh, look cool. I'm like, well, I've been trying that for 36 years and it's just not working out. Do I look cool with my hot dog pants, my knee highs? Well, that looked fucking cool. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, don't track the ball, track me. <laughs> they made us do a car bomb, they made me have this whiskey, so if I'm being totally honest, I don't know what hole this is, but we're teetering on the edge of 
We might not. We might not make it to the end. The carbon raw athletic ability. Chief, where are we at right now? We're in Connecticut. We're somewhere in Connecticut. Avon, Connecticut. Hole 17. What hole are we on? Dude, I don't. I don't know where you're at. I have no. Well, he wouldn't know. Car bomb station number two. This is like the. This is like the trick of this event. Is that you just go by this four times and then you're blacked out. No idea what happens after. Who designed this shit? It. Have you guys already done time. this before? Yes. <laughs> no, this is before. like. What? I am. I'm like five minutes above flying to your mom. I did not want to run this whole. I can't believe he's got okay, a good one. Okay, how about the 21 year old? I know you're going to I'm not doing three. <laughs> Will, when Get your camera out of here. That was Colonel, that was Colonel. That was Colonel. You didn't finish? All right, that's my third one, second one. So what? I would have used it. It was Colonel and I would have used it. I did not nail it. See that blue tent? Yeah. Right in the middle of it. So if you use the tree, yeah, right, exactly. That's what I saw. Balance and look cool. Kinda, kinda. I'm not right. sure my team's not paying my team's. Yeah, it's 15 times. I'm gonna have to make it. <laughs> I just decided I'm gonna have to make it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try my best I want to make, you to make it. it. But I if I don't make it, it, you know who's fault it is. Yeah, but then I'll make it for you. I'll make it after if you don't make it. But I want you to absolutely cause a scene. Like Rory right, Mackerel. Right there. I want a Rory Mackerel. I'm going to do the Tiger. I want bolt. something special. You know what I'm, you know I'm going to do for this shot, though? Put him off that fucking good vibes. Like I said, we love you. Going. Oh, it's good. Great yeah, I, mean, I wanted that as bad as I had, as had the tournament on the line right there, and I look at. I'm not. It is a way. It is a way. There's no I in team, but there's a, there's an I in win, and there's also an I in Brian. Yeah, when you spell it the right when you spell it the right way. Partner? The dogs. The dogs. I can tell you what. Great time. Great time. Great, great couple you. hours. What a Jay, beautiful. Keep coming back. I I told your parents I'll be here every year that I'm. In What's up, guys? Carl, where have you been? What are you talking about? I've been looking for you all day. I'm so sorry. I owe everybody an apology, guys. I am so sorry, everybody. Kevin, I would like to apologize. Danny, Hannah, I'm sorry. Sean, you don't even fucking work for us. I'm sorry. I'd like to apologize. Uh, everybody, I've just been running around like crazy today. Harry, look at me when I give you a, an apology, for Christ's sakes. I'm apologizing. I've been running around all day today. Things are crazy. I'm for trying to fulfill my ADHD medication. And it's just, I'm just driving around doctor's office, pick up this and that. So I don't want to hear it from you, young lady. I've been driving all over the suburbs of Chicago. Doctor visits here, this and that, prescription medicine. And for the life of me, this is it. I've had it. I'm switching to Innovative Care. I'm switching to InnovativeADD.com because it's time that I manage this prescription way better. I'm all over the place. I need compassion. I need care. I need people who give a shit, Kevin. I'm apologizing, but I was gone all day today. Didn't write any blogs. No blogs. How many blogs did I write today, Lance? Don't answer that. Where am I? Out here. Doing what? <laughs> Run around like crazy. InnovativeADD.com for all your prescription medication needs. Take insurance. Must be a resident of Illinois. So for all you national people, sorry, move to Illinois. Get a piece of InnovativeADD.com. Manage your ADHD medication now. And don't raise your voice with me like that. We're, we're supposed to be cool, we're supposed to be friends. I need ADHD meds. I... Check out InnovativeADD.com for all your prescription management needs for your ADHD medication. All right, let's get back to stool scenes. Action, Thursday morning, fucking 8.57 a.m. on my way out to Iowa for the Field of Dreams game. It's me a good trip, guys. Cubs are not good, Reds are not good, but people say that uh, Dyersville, Indiana, Going to Iowa for fuck's sake, Carl. Dyersville, Iowa is uh, bucket list material. We'll go see some Cubs fans. Watch where you're going, lady. Take a wave. Go Cubs! Who are you cheering for tonight, young lady? What's that? Who are you cheering for tonight? Neither one. I don't do baseball. Okay, you don't I need do to it. Your parking pass. 
Oh, oh, okay. I thought you guys were just holding stuff here. Nope. I'm cheering for, uh, I don't know who else is playing. Just like a fair and balanced game, huh? Okay, good. Good attitude. Who are you cheering for tonight? Us. Yes. You? Red. Ah! <laughs> Almost got into an accident just to ask the Iowa State Troopers who they're cheering for. <laughs> Smells like Iowa. Who are you cheering for tonight? Sox fan. Fuck you. Who are you cheering for tonight? Oh, Jiminy Christmas. I'm a Mets fan. Oh, Jiminy. So I can't. Eh, n neither? We'll Couple last place, place teams. teams. Sounds like a Mets fan. No sympathy. Who are you cheering for? I'm a Sox fan. <laughs> Not good. A lot, lot of Sox fans in, in Iowa. We've arrived, Field of Dreams. Boys on the golf What's cart. Up? You got to sneak in a shot. Uh, the merch line. Holy tamale. It's a once in a lifetime opportunity for merch, guys. On site, this is right where Gray Leota was taking flies, uh, right where we beat starting nine last year when I wasn't a part of starting nine. Might be wondering how do you get to the stadium because it's all the way through there. Fun fact, you actually just walk through the corn. Uh, let's take a nice corn walk, follow me. Two, two, two outs, nobody on, two run lead, Roanwick, the pitch. Boom! Let's go, Shulis Joe's dead! Three, two, two outs, nobody on, two run lead, Roanwick, the set, the pitch, the swing. Yeah, baby! <laughs> I can't tell if I just showed you guys the moon or the fucking lights, but it's gorgeous out here. Beautiful setting, the boys are coming in here. Oh! Okay, I'm not showing you guys all the fireworks. Nobody likes that guy, I will say this. Electric setting tonight, unbelievable crowd. I was great. Listen, the merch was expensive, okay? I don't want to tell you how much it's had it cost because you guys won't ever fucking listen to a word I say. There's a sucker coming. Carl spends 40 on a hat. That's how much it was. We lose the prop bet, we win the Cubs minus one and a half plus 140. Like I said, unbelievable setting. Glad we got a chance to play the Reds. One of the few teams we can beat in a situation like this. We'll see you guys in downtown Dubuque, Iowa. Let's go. For a couple, hey, how you doing? I had like half a gallon, you didn't know. What happened? Dave was craving milk and cookies. Threw me a 20. He said he was craving milk and cookies and threw Hannah a 20. So this, this is the guy we won last year. He, this, he goes on like a milk cycle. Yeah. Ew. So, uh, guy just crushed his milk. Why do you feel the need to do that for Dave? I, I, I panicked. I didn't know I could say no. He said, oh, you yeah, know, I'm craving milk and cookies right now. <laughs> he's definitely not your boss. I, and I was just holding the 20. He's gone. I mean, seems a little elitist by White Sox Dave, but. What is? Yeah, what are your legs broken? Can't get your own cookies. I thought we were starting to run down 20 minutes ago. Well, it was nine minutes ago, not 20. What does that have to do with anything? I love your change on your laptop. I think you Man, should. that for you. Oh. Hey. Who would you give her? 10? We... No, you gave me a 20. I think you gave me a 10 just now. Worth it. I mean, that's a big delivery fee. That's more that you could have. She earned it. You could have done Uber it. Eats and gotten you better cookies than milk. Was... That How was a flop. Feeling better? Mm-hmm. This guy's in a good mood today. Well, White, Sox win, he, White Sox win five games, and all of a sudden he's just like so chipper. They affect my mood way too much. I can't, I can't Do you think that. any of your internet outbursts in the last couple of weeks were that other people caught track yeah, yeah. of were directly related to the White Sox? Tangentially related to the White Sox. Do you want to apologize to anybody? Uh, no. <laughs> I was still speaking the truth. How do you feel about counseling and unconseling the White Sox? Kevin Clancy can suck my ball sack for one, for two. I know it's against the rules, but they hit a five-game streak, two of them against the best team in baseball, at least the AL. It is what it is. Just got to ride the ride the wave. That's what I'm doing. How do you guys feel about that? I mean, a console is supposed to be permanent. Yeah. It's supposed to be a gravestone. They're not dead. They're a game back. White Sox, Dave's words put his ass in the jackpot yet again. I'm not not yet again. <laughs> Which I could say I was surprised. <laughs> That's what I have to say. Mm. 
<laughs> Let's do a rundown. <laughs> oh man, I haven't gotten on one of these in fucking forever. Air Force Ones are kind of skateboarding shoes a little bit. I haven't touched a skateboard and I'm hungover and my shoulder hurts. I used to skateboard a little bit. Kind of. When it was like the X Games was a cool thing. That was the slowest fall I've ever seen. Because I caught myself. I